name is Lauren and today I want to show you how to make this monogram pocket t-shirt. The font I used for the monogram is the Pello Small Embroidery font and can be found at the Apex Embroidery Fonts and Designs website. Let's get started. To make our pocket t-shirt, you'll need a plain cotton t-shirt and a piece of fabric measuring 5.5 inches by 12 inches. This piece of fabric will be used to make your pocket. First you want to mark the center of your pocket. I folded my piece of fabric in half with the folded edge at the top and I've marked the center of my fabric with disappearing ink for my monogram. I've placed my fabric in my embroidery hoop. We're only going to monogram through one layer of the fabric. When we go to make our pocket, we'll be folding our pocket back in half so that the back portion of the pocket is covered and no monogram threads show. I've snapped the embroidery hoop into the embroidery machine. Now we're ready for our monogram. I did put a piece of tearaway stabilizer behind the fabric so that we get a nice clean monogram. Now that my monogram is complete, I tore away the tearaway stabilizer that was on the back of the monogram. Next, I folded my fabric back in half with the right sides facing inward. Then I drew with the disappearing ink the approximate shape I want my pocket. Um, I'm going to sew along the edges all the way around except for an inch over here on this side where I'm going to use to turn the pocket right side out. And we'll show you how that will produce a nice pocket without any rough edges. Now that we've sewn our pocket all the way around the edges, except we left one little inch over here, we can take the pocket and we're going to turn it right side out. Now that our pocket is turned right side out, I'm going to go take an iron and I'll tuck this in and then I'll press it flat so that it's easy to sew right onto our t-shirt. Now that we have our pocket pressed flat and our open seam tucked in, we're gonna sew a stitch right across the top here so that it resembles a pocket. Once you have your top stitch sewn, go ahead and pin the pocket to your shirt. I encourage you to try your shirt on just to be sure the pocket placement is exactly where you want it. And if it's not, that's okay. Just reposition it and repin it before we begin sewing. Once you have it where you want it, we're going to put a stitch here, 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 and back up. That way it leaves the pocket open, just in case you want to stick your phone or keys in there. Let's begin sewing. Once you're done with your stitching, you can remove the pins. I did go over these seams up here twice just to be sure that through a few washes, the seams stay intact and that the pocket is nice and durable. Thanks for joining me for today's tutorial. For more monogramming and embroidery tutorials, subscribe to the Apex Embroidery YouTube channel. If you enjoyed watching, please give this video a thumbs up by clicking like below. Leave your ideas for more Apex Embroidery tutorials in the comments below. Thanks for watching.